Good morning. How is everyone? Uh, happy Saturday. Um, let me see if I can invite some people. Uh, invite my daughter, Katie. Wake up, baby. Your daddy's online. Try to get some more people on. Don't really have much to talk about today. Um, I have to apologize for the uh, show, the uh show, because that's all I did was say uh, the uh show <laughs> that I did this week. Um, my, hi, Susan. My guest on Biomed RX Radio uh, changed, and so I had to wing it. So this was the first week that I did, and, and I have enough material. Um, I have enough material to to wing it. I have enough commercials. I'm trying to sell enough products online. I, uh, yeah, yeah. So I have enough things to read. Wow, who's this guy? Hmm. I'm looking a little bit more like him lately. Interesting. Well, um, if anybody wants to know why I'm feeling so good, I won't even tell you because I can't. I don't want to get in trouble. There are people trying to stop me from uh, talking about the uh, things that I'm doing right now. I think my uh, holistic health program is getting getting a little bit dangerous, getting a little bit to the point where uh, I'm taking some risks because... I'm talking about things that can cure cancer and reverse HIV positive status and um, reverse autism and autism diagnosis, reverse herpes, reverse uh, a lot of uh, different diseases and infections, hepatitis, um, reverse end stage renal disease, and actually help uh, with diabetes, believe it or not. But you're going to have to contact me personally in order to, for me to talk about this because there are individuals and probably organizations out there that are just waiting for me to associate uh, the BiomedRx name with uh, these wonderful things. And uh, although I would like to, we live in a, a political and legal climate that does not permit me to do that at this moment. So uh, just give me a call and I'll tell you what my secrets are. Uh, when you have a chance. Here's looking at you. There you go. So what are we going to do? Well, it's a nice overcast day in Southern California. It's a nice rainy day. Um, I don't know. Hey, Kai, what do you want to do today, man? Come say hi. Everyone knows the Kai Kai man. Hello. Kai Odin Lockett. So? Sew buttons on your underwear. No, wait. No. No. <laughs> you don't want to sew buttons on your underwear? So? I want to go to Big Al's. Oh, you want to go to Big Al's? So I can go bowling. You want to go bowling today? Yeah, and I can challenge my dad. And give those pins a taste of their own medicine. You are, huh? Yeah. You're going to beat me at bowling? Yeah. You know, he lets me. I mean, he beats me, and I don't let him. He beats me at bowling, honestly and fair and square. Yeah, and I give those pins a taste of their own medicine. You do, don't you? Mm -hmm. We haven't been bowling in a while. No. You have a point there, son. Yeah. Maybe we should go bowling. Yes. Okay, let's do that. That sounds like fun. Yes. All right. Woohoo. Woo <laughs> yeah, it's good. Bowling and pizza. It's a bowling and pizza day for me and Kai. For Kai and me. 
anyway, uh, thanks for joining. I mean, you know, I would love to have more to tell you, but I think I've already shared everything about uh, all of our vitamins and uh, the uh, Biomed RX Health Center and all of our therapies. And uh, I guess that's about it. Um, everybody be healthy. Hey, what's up, Howard? Uh, trying to tell everybody to be healthy and take care of yourselves. We have no clients. It's a nice rainy day in Southern California. I love it. It's raining. My God, uh, we need it. We're always in a state of drought. Um, we need it. We need the rain. We need the water. We need the hydration. So all of the Earthship homes are getting their uh, reservoirs filled with water. That's what I wanted to talk to you guys about. Earth ships. Look up Earth ships, okay? Earth ships. These are homes that are built very cheaply out of tires and bottles and concrete and plaster and, and all kind of different things. And uh, they're um, completely off the grid. They're able to maintain the temperature because they're surrounded by earth. They're able to maintain a, a, a regular temperature, a, a pretty comfortable temperature throughout the year. Um, they're all facing the south so that they get the sunlight all year. Um, there are people who are recycling gray water into the plants. And uh, then the black water uh, goes out to uh, vegetate, to, to uh, fertilize your vegetation outside. And uh, it's a pretty interesting thing. I want to build an earth ship, okay? This is the plan. I want to buy a piece of land. I want to put a double-wide trailer on it. That's right, a trailer. I'm going to live in the trailer, and I'm going to slowly and surely build my earth ship home on a piece of land that I own here in California. Um, so that's the plan. That's what I'm trying to do. Um, but I highly recommend looking up earth ships. Uh, earth ship homes are, uh, they're beautiful and uh, um, they reduce our ecological footprint on the earth. So, uh, you know, we're not causing so much damage to the planet. And uh, let me think. Um, it's a, a, you know, I want my house to be able to survive off grid. But of course, I'm going to be providing electricity to the grid because I intend on building a solar farm. And therefore, um, I'm going to always have more than enough power because one acre of solar uh, photovoltaic cells, one acre of solar farm can actually supply enough electricity for 50 houses. So if I get a couple of acres and dedicate an acre to um, solar farm, then I should be able to get a check from the electric company every month for the electricity that I'm feeding into the grid. And, uh, you know, I'll always have power and my batteries for my house and for the things that I want. But that's just a little personal thing. This week, um, we're going to have Miss Marcia Hines the author of this book. I know you're in there. This is a book about autism and her struggle with her son, Ryan, um, and how she was able to reverse his autism using a number of uh, different, different techniques. And uh, if you look in this month's of, this month of Renaissance Magazine, oh, Radiance, I'm sorry. This month of uh, Radiance Magazine, um, there's an article about yours truly on page 24, how Devin Lockett reversed his son's autism, and that's a picture of me and Kai at the place that we're going to go right now, Big Al's. And uh, that's from my friend Scott Ware. And if you remember a couple of weeks ago, I interviewed Miss Kerry Rivera, my good friend, and uh, her book, um, Healing the Symptoms Known as Autism. Uh, 
And I learned a lot of valuable information for which I am benefiting at this moment um, from Kerry. And uh, so we're just going on and on and on. I'm still in the process of picking a co-host. If uh, people are interested in trying out for a co-host position, please give me a call at uh, 424-204-2389. And, uh, you know, we're going to have someone else online, someone who can help me sell these vitamins while I'm interviewing my clients. I mean, my guests, I need someone to interject and interrupt and say, hey, buy some vitamins. <laughs> Don't look at my password. Anyway, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I hope you guys are healthy um, today. If you're not feeling good, um, give me a call. If you would like to train your brain for peak performance, Give me a holler. It really does work. If you would like to use the David, I'm going to keep pushing this David device, okay, because people don't understand the value of Mind Alive products. Mind Alive products are the bomb. This is the Mind Alive David. I'm going to go over this one more time for you guys, okay? It is a brain entrainment device. We train the brain through visual stimuli, auditory stimuli, and electrical stimuli, all in combination. You put it on like this. The headphones go on your ears. The LED light uh, glasses go on your eyes. And right is for red, okay, and black is for the left. Okay, so we clip these onto your ears. Polarity is important. Actually, you have to have the right, uh, the red one on the right for the headphones as well. So you wear it like this, 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 and you have a number of settings that you can put it on. Settings that uh, relate to. There we go. Settings that relate to energize. <clears throat> As to wake you up like a cup of coffee in the morning, you see the little lightning flash. Meditate, that's to get you into a calm state of meditation and relaxation. Brain booster, that actually improves the uh, function of your brain. It actually makes your brain work better. It literally can make you smarter. Sleep. If you're having trouble getting to sleep, you want to relax and go to sleep. And see the smiley face? That's mood booster, okay? That actually can make you feel happy. But what's going on is uh, you're looking at flashes of light of varying colors, um, Chromotherapy, I guess you could say. You're listening to uh, isochronic tones and binaural beats, which are through the headphones, which provides you with auditory entrainment. And most importantly, you're getting small electrical pulses on your earlobes that stimulate the regulation of your endorphins in your brain. Like I said, uh, most people are serotonin starved. Serotonin is what you need to have high self-esteem and to feel good and to feel happy. Um, yeah, serotonin, okay? It's, it's, it's uh, very closely related to self-esteem. Whenever you have a fearful thought or a fearful, yeah, uh, notion enter your head, the first thing that happens is your frontal lobe becomes starved of serotonin. The serotonin is reduced in your frontal lobe. And uh, so you're in panic mode. You're in fight or flight mode. You're in fearful mode. You're not 
capable of recognizing um, facial expressions like uh, like you do when you're calm and when you're relaxed and happy. And uh, so you can't can't really muster up empathy, <clears throat> empathy for other people because you're 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 not there. Your 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 brain is deprived of serotonin. And uh, so you don't uh, you do that. You either fight, you either become aggressive or you fly, you flee, uh, fight or flight. You retreat into yourself and you let people walk all over you. You become a pushover. You don't want to be a pushover. And you don't want to be uh, an a-hole either. You don't want to be the kind of person that's just aggressively in people's face. You want to be balanced. So you definitely want to try uh, CES. You definitely want to try the Mind Alive devices. And let me tell you, to combine um, the Mind Alive David with the uh, neural feedback proce uh, procedures that we offer here at the Biomed RX Health Center is really, really powerful, okay? Because the uh, balance that you get of your endorphins makes the work that you do with neural feedback much more effective. Okay, I could go on, and maybe I should go on, but I'm going to leave that just right there. Um, everyone could use uh, a little tune-up between the ears, and um, the therapies that we do here at the Biomed RX Health Center are designed for just that, you know. But, you know, enough about us. Let's talk about you. Are there any questions that you'd like for me to ask Marsha Hines uh, during our interview this coming Wednesday? Are there any things that you, any topics that you would like me to cover on Biomed RX Radio? Type them in or send them to me in my inbox and uh, I'll consider them for future episodes and for future shows. Are, are there any controversial subjects you'd like me to explore? Are there any controversial health practices that you'd like me to check out. Let me know. And uh, once again, I love you all. I want you to be healthy and happy and take care of yourselves. Enjoy your weekend. Enjoy uh, your Saturday and um, take care. Thank you.